What's up everybody? My name is Sophie Brown and this is G Buzz where you can get your latest entertainment news. Ha! Huh, today I can't wait to spill out the tea. Thanks to Cheesy Pizza for sponsoring today's news. So stay right there, don't go anywhere. Notice right there. Ghanaian JHS graduate Kelvin Odate, who made himself a Ferrari from scraps and showcased it in his area, has reached the global storytelling platform Nas Daily. Now, Nas Daily did a fundraiser to raise money for the 18 year old boy. Within a week, they had 15,000 US dollars, equivalent to 85,000 Ghana cities for the young man, and in addition, several job opportunities. Now, this is what I talk about when I'm talking about investment. You need to invest in what you have in your own country. And the cops trying to chase us because we stole a couple scenes and we smashed a couple bars because we know that we can. Food actor Idris Elba has been making waves as a rapper and also a DJ. He said he's got hits on the horizon. He also added that he has a banger with Nigerian musician Davido and also the US rapper Megan the Stallion. I'm a savage. Yeah. Classy, bougie, wretched. Yeah. Yes. So I can't wait for that song to come out because it's going to be a bad, bad, bad banger. Spotify is now live in many more countries in Africa. Tell them Africa we don't die. Spotify, the world's most popular global audio streaming subscription service, is now available in Ghana, Nigeria, Uganda, Kenya. So you need to start streaming all your songs from that place already because I have started mine. What is he waiting for? Download now and start streaming now. Nigerian singer Joe Boy made a shocking statement in a recent interview that he is single but also not searching because of his entanglement with a much, much older lady. And then he also describes himself as a sugar boy. As you can see, the way he was talking, he was really proud of it. Yeah, very proud. He says he is so free as long as the lady is also free and then the relationship is dope. And that's on period. Says I'm love you. I'm a kiss you. We have a taste. Thank you for your portion. I want to use this platform to congratulate Ghanaian Kume with actor Kweku Menu for reuniting Funny Face and his kids and wife together again. It was a long process, he said, and also said in a recent interview with Zion Felix that the doctors said Funny Face had a good sleep and also slept early as soon as he saw his kids and his baby mama. I mean, this is what we can do for a fellow brother rather than to wake up the next morning and see beef all around, Samini and Shatawali. The next thing you see is Monaguchi and if you're Shatsnika. I mean, there is more to this entertainment industry than just beef. Entertainment industry is not just about beef, there's more to it. There are a lot of things we are not doing. Let's get work started rather than having beef all around. I mean, duh, I'm so pissed. Have you guys heard that 60,000 coronavirus vaccines has been brought to Ghana? You guys be careful out there though. But my suggestion is that you people should try it on animals before you try it on we human beings because we have no idea what the vaccine contains. I mean, I already heard that there was no vaccine for the coronavirus and now I'm hearing that there are vaccines in Ghana. Okay, you're welcome vaccines. Mostly welcome. And this brings us to the end of today's news. Don't forget to follow our social media platform at GB Africa News and also on our website www.gbafrican.net and also on our YouTube, GBTV Africa. My name is Sambi Brown and I'm always, always there for you to deliver to you the best and nothing but the best. <laughs> Thanks to Cheesy Pizza for sponsoring today's news. Make sure you be yourself and love yourself. Mine.